Understanding the phrase, sandpaper smooth, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we explore the fascinating world of English phrases and idioms. Today, we're diving into the intriguing phrase, sandpaper smooth. This might sound contradictory at first, but let's unravel its meaning together. Stay tuned to learn how this phrase can add a unique flavor to your English conversations. Sandpaper smooth is a compound adjective. It combines two words that seem opposite, sandpaper, a rough material used for smoothing surfaces, and smooth, which means free from roughness or bumps. This phrase is a classic example of an oxymoron, where two contradictory terms are used together to create a unique expression. The phrase, sandpaper smooth, is often used to describe something that is extremely smooth. So smooth that it's like it has been finely sanded. It implies a level of smoothness that is achieved through careful and thorough effort, similar to how sandpaper is used to refine and polish a surface. This phrase can be used both literally, such as in woodworking or crafting, and metaphorically in various contexts. Let's look at some examples to see how sandpaper smooth can be used in everyday language. 1. After hours of sanding, the wooden table was sandpaper smooth. 2. The negotiator's skills were sandpaper smooth, effortlessly resolving the conflict. 3. She played the piano with a sandpaper smooth touch, each note flowing seamlessly into the next. When using the phrase, sandpaper smooth, avoid the mistake of thinking it means something rough. Remember, despite involving the word, sandpaper, the phrase emphasizes smoothness achieved through refinement. It's not about the roughness of sandpaper but the result it achieves. And that's a wrap on, sandpaper smooth. I hope this explanation helps you understand and use this unique English phrase confidently in your conversations. Remember, language is full of surprises, and phrases like these make it all the more exciting. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe for more English language learning content. See you in the next video!